What up guys, hope you're all well and safe. Today I'm going to show you how to make this simple but delicious salad paired with a teriyaki salmon. The parsley salad is inspired by one of my uncles and aunts, Jude Mama and Manori Punchi. One of the dishes the whole family loves and looks forward to whenever we go around to theirs. So, without further ado, let's get cracking. To start things off, soak your brown lentils in water for about an hour or two and then cook them on medium heat for about 45 minutes. You don't want your lentils to be cooked through, otherwise the salad is going to become all mushy. So they need a bit of bite for this salad. So once that's done, drain them and set aside to cool. Next, we're going to prepare the parsley, tomatoes and red onions. Finely chop the parsley as shown, the finer the better. Then dice the red onions into small cubes and with the tomatoes, quarter them, take the seeds out, slice and chop them into little cubes as well. For the dressing, we're going to need lemon juice, mustard, olive oil, a bit of mayo, salt, pepper, and give it a good whisk and you'll end up with this beautiful and delicious salad dressing. And this will work in other salads too. Next, let's prepare the salmon. For the teriyaki sauce, you're gonna start off with some soy sauce, a bit of honey, some garlic powder, some ginger powder, black pepper, and chili flakes and give these guys a good mix as well. Now you can substitute the garlic powder and ginger powder for their fresh counterparts, but I find it's easier to mix and marinates the fish much better this way. A list of fish that will go well with the sauce and of course will be in the description box below as usual. Let the fish steaks marinate for about 30 minutes and in the meantime, let's finish preparing our salad. So in your salad bowl full of parsley, onions and tomatoes, add in your drained and cooled brown lentils along with with your salad dressing and give it all a good mix. One thing I love about this salad, aside from how good it is for you and how delicious it is, is all those beautiful colors. You can keep this in the refrigerator until it needs to be served. Next up, let's fry the fish steaks in a drizzle of olive oil and I suggest you cook them slowly because the honey in the sauce will want to burn quite quickly. So be patient and cook the fish in a low heat. This is another healthy recipe that the whole family will enjoy. You've got the beautiful flavors from the teriyaki sauce in the fish steak coupled with the tangy and refreshing salad on the side it makes for an amazing combo great source of protein great source of healthy fats what more can you ask for i hope you guys enjoyed this recipe if you did please do leave a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and follow me on instagram and facebook hope you all take care of yourselves stay safe and i'll catch you all very soon so until next time Peace.